What is up guys, Austin Richo here, back again playing Jurassic World Evolution, continuing on on Isla Pena here, uh, continuing on with our story, I guess you could say, and so I'm just getting ready here to do the last mission, the security mission on the island here, and in the process of doing it, I did unlock, um, let's see, what do we have, so we still gotta do the large power station. Oh, I still haven't unlocked that. I thought I did already. But the large power station and the Sukumimus. Did we get everything? Oh, we gotta do Carnotaurus over there. So I thought I assumed I was done with everything. I did completely get the Kentro done here so we can sell all these off now. Now I do have a new mouse and keyboard for this recording, so I don't know how things are gonna go. Like the mouse is too sensitive for me, and I've turned the sensitivity all the way down and it's still having issues and stuff, so it's kind of um kind of going crazy over here so let's get a new contract just that going security isn't always clean or easy sure that's it's not too bad necessary. uh but so let's go in here now out. um but anyways in doing so i was able to let's look in here real quick i got the electrified concrete fence oh there's the mission field testing thing so i got the electrified concrete fence unlocked so i went ahead and replaced all this down here because it'll be used for stuff and then up over in here for the baryonics i replaced it as well but let's go ahead and start our mission for today so we're going to come in here and we're going to do security mission number four and so we've got to do a matriacan source ceratosaurus and a tyrannosaurus rex so let's go ahead and start the mission Good here We've been tasked with incubating, yeah, so we need to do housing modified new stock. We're going to do a ceratosaurus first because that'd probably be the easiest of aggressive instincts. So let's go in here and get the aggressive instincts of the ceratosaurus, which I may already have. No, I probably won't actually. Maybe let's go with the wetland. So it was aggressive instincts, which will probably under this one. Their aggressive instincts and we will apply that one there so hopefully that should be it let's just see if it says anything else with aggressive instincts mod okay that's all it says so we will incubate that and then we'll go ahead and do the matria can source with increased bone density so where's the matria down here right there with increased bone density we'll just leave the, that perfect increase bone density apply surely i just did the right thing right let's check it again just to make sure yes my tree got the source with increased bone density and surely that will be hopefully because it just says one so i assume as long as one thinks because i do believe there are more than one so now we gotta sit and wait for that. Hopefully none of those die. I didn't think about uh, you know, lowering the other stuff. But we have our Matriacanthosaurus over here ready to go. Um, so room for another one over in here. And everything's all good. Of course have all our Chasmosaurs over here. Being all happy. Still haven't put anything in here. Can't find really anything that fits besides smaller dinos. But I'm not ready for smaller dinos yet. Then we have all our... I don't know what you'd call them, ankyloids, I guess, or something. So with our ankylosauruses. I know you've handled work like this oh. in the past, so this contract I would be right love to do that mission because I need the security thing, but I cannot find carnivore fossils anywhere. What's that? Okay, these things keep dying off on me. But oh well, it's not a big deal. Asset. But we're gonna put the ceratosaurus into here, so I got the concrete all marked out and everything. Still need herbivores put in here and over in this one as well but of course that would be something i do after i finish all the missions and just like free play and stuff because i'm done with carnivores i only do in carnivores that it needs to do and then i did just these just to get the ratings increased and everything so as you can see we got the lighted fences up they're still going to break out but we have it there just in case i thought there was another baryon oh there it is this one baryonyx just keeps like sitting over here at this wall <laughs> Like, I'm surprised it's not attacking the wall, but it's got good comfort, but it just keeps sitting there staring at that wall. It's kind of weird. So our ceratosaurus is going to be good, which is no surprise. Oh yeah, it's up to 60. This one may be an issue. Not exactly sure. We'll have to see how it goes. 
But I went ahead, just went out, switched these walls, as I mentioned, for the electrified. Oh. Um, just because, uh, like, I had put the extra barrier for that T Rex thing, and we're gonna have. That's not what I wanted at all. We had the uh, next T Rex mission coming up, or T Rex coming up for this mission, so I figured. Acknowledged. Might as well, um, or in the last one, it may have just been the, the way the T-Rex was, but it had comfort issues. So I'm like, well, maybe since that's taking up some of the grass or something, it'll help. But I'm not exactly sure, but I hope it all works out. And then we don't have much left over here. We have a Gallimimus, Gallimimus, Gallimimus. Those were from the mission. And that's pretty much all we have. They're pretty much all about to be dead, it looks like. Which is fine. We can always resupply them later on. Not that they're really worth anything. Okay, so we are above. We're getting close on the Ceratosaurus. It's up the 90s. Just sitting here waiting now. Playing the waiting game. Do, 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 do. Any moment now. It's about to be done, at least. I don't think I can do that guest thing. Because I don't think I have enough hotels... But, I don't know, maybe putting in these new dinos or something will help get it above or something. Ooh, that's a weird looking Ceratosaurus. So we will go ahead and trank you out there. Hopefully that thing will check off for the Ceratosaurus. There it goes, okay. should be going down. <laughs> I like how the truck stopped right in front of it. There it goes. And now we will move it over to its new home. Hopefully it'll be comfortable in there. I'll probably have to get rid of some of these trees. Because I don't think they like too many trees. There, hopefully it'll live nice and fruitful life in that place or in that whatever you call it location look at all our happy friendly people yeah nothing's doing nothing's full up yet nope how many guests do we have in our park uh, we need about a little under a thousand more Asset there we go Matria is ready to go Okay, let's look at the T-Rex. What do we need? There may be something wrong with this door here. Yeah, the tree is in there somewhere. Anyways, let's go. So we need tooth hardness for T-Rex. Tooth hardness. I assume that's going to be... one of these things maybe yeah tooth hardness we'll just go with that one leave everything else we'll change the color of it a little we'll go with step pattern see how that thing looks and incubate hopefully that doesn't fail but we've got a pretty good base amount of money coming on now there it goes Matria has been released Happy little dinosaur. Is it going down? There it goes. And it's asleep. And we'll move it over here with its family. Or its other friend. Let's see, is that one delivered yet? Oh, it's almost delivered. Let's see if we have to make any changes to the base for it. some good Delivery profit complete. there oh, yeah. need some grasslands it looks like hopefully this is enough space of course that like completely tore out everything oh my god this doesn't look like it's gonna be big enough well shoot 
Okay, um, maybe it'll go over here. They're not too bad Adding to find comfort, so maybe it'll fit in here. It, that looks maybe a little bit bigger. I don't know. Very disappointing. Go ahead and resupply this feeder. Feeder resupply request received. I bet this T-Rex is going to take forever. Oh, it's up to 20 something. It may take a while. Hopefully, I think I may pause here for a second and let this be taken, um, switched out and get the T-Rex ready to go. Oh, and of course we got some storms coming in. Gotta love the storms coming. Delivery has been completed. Hopefully it won't destroy everything. Let's try over in here. Because I'm pretty sure it's a little bit bigger. If not, maybe put it in here because that's a pretty big space. And should get the food going and all... Yeah, everyone's running into the bases. Let's check our guy over here. Yeah, he's doing pretty good. Hopefully no tornadoes come and destroy. So I'm going to get this guy transported. Hopefully it'll fit and get the T-Rex done. And I will be back once everything's ready to go. So I'll see you then. Okay, so I think everything's all finished out. So we had a st that storm and everything. Of course, destroyed a bunch of stuff. The uh, Cerasaurus is finally in there and getting comfort. It just made it through the thresholds of grasslands and forests and everything. And so hopefully... And I went ahead and did the electric fence because it kept breaking out even though it wasn't comfort and everything. Um, and now there, the comfort's going up. So the T-Rex is done now too. So let's come over here and release the T-Rex. <coughs> See what it looks. Ooh, I like the color, of course, with this light and everything on the Isla pin. It's hard to see exactly what it looks like. But I think... Uh, there we go. And we have a disease. Is it one of the new dinos? These particular specimens will be for export and used on assignment. So they need So as of right now it's in comfort, but export? it was last time too. Well, isn't that uh, uh, the Casmosaur? Insanity? Don't they already have their hands full watching them on these islands? Give it that. Okay, so transport use the transport team to loan each of the dinos. So that means I think we have to knock th uh, them out I would assume task. yeah it's the third one the there then we'll come over here and knock them out because I know I read a thing that says how you're supposed to do this mission and no so you problem. knock them out and then they go away and then come back so that's why I have to kind of have the bases set up for them so now I think we can come over here we click and then R to loan the dinosaur. So the T-Rex is going away. I don't know if they'll come back like pretty much immediately. I don't know if you have to wait a little bit. Not for sure. Okay, so that was the right one. Good, good. And R. There we go, we'll loan that. It's hard to see because with this new keyboard, it's got like shiny letters. So I can't see because of the light I have. I can't see, so I'm trying to make sure I hit the right buttons. And R, that one too. So there we go. Loaning each of the dinosaurs out. Goodbye, T-Rex. gonna go ahead and do that Drake or Rex thing but I guess maybe I shouldn't because I think you have to do I I'm trying to remember how many Drake or Rex I think you have to have four Drake or Rexes because that may be Asset something I need underway. to do later because I eventually would like to just have a T-Rex in here permanently but obviously since I only have that one and this one as our uh, incubator things Asset. I don't think it would be very smart. I need to like be nice if I could have like attached it on the here because I just need like a separate little pin that I'm not going to use for hardly anything. It would have been nice but I think it's way too big. The hammer creation lab to fit here and I'd have to f get everything filled out and everything. Uh, kind of stinks. 
Unless the Baryonyx is. Let's see how much stuff. Oh, they have just here. enough grassland. Nice work getting that I don't know done. how much space difference there is. To receive our animals back in staggered shipments. Deliver to the island in intervals. Oh, so there's a little... Dr. Wu has reported that some may be diseased or in less than... Diseased? I don't condition. want diseased dinos. Let's get on this. Bring these animals back up to our standards. Yeah, bring them back we'll to, to our standards. need to do this before they can be reintroduced to the island. Get this done without asking too many questions. And by too many questions, I mean any questions at all. Okay, Dr. How Wu. How and why I... We do what we do. Is above you just pay calm pay. yourself down. Well, that should be clear to you by now. What's the matria? Could it be? You know, it like just has enough grassland too. Let's not argue over the small stuff. Looking at the big picture, this is a solid sure. contract. Whatever the reason, this. So let's go ahead and just do our mastery over dinosaurs. What's this the is thing again? The kajingasaurus. Turning them on each other isn't going to get us there. Go ahead and do those again. Hopefully. So we got it two. So I could knock one of these out. Just so it guarantees to fight the proper one. Is this one like dying or something? Nope, it's only 34. <laughs> How old's that one? 36, it's just a couple, a little time older. As soon as those get done, I'll probably knock one of those out. And we're awaiting the dinosaur, so I may have to just sit here and wait for that to happen and bring it back once they get back here, because there's nothing else I can really do. And I don't know which dinosaur they're gonna be returning back to me. Not exactly sure, so I will, I guess, wait here and I'll see you once they bring something back maybe um, it looks like it's going pretty fast though so it'll just be a few minutes but I will see you then okay so the T-Rex is now coming back so I'll go and just plant it back Asset into the pin here and of course it's got a disease I don't know what has I assume it's the T-Rex it's referring to that has the disease because I know T-Rex or the dinos are going to be coming back with diseases so let's go ahead in here and wait for that. So it's got food and water. And we can cure it. Yes, we want the fight to begin because I released the Kajingasaurus to fight the Baryonyx. Hopefully it's the Kajingasaurus that's dying, I hope. Come here, T-Rexy. You got to get your healing on. Oh, it's taking forever. Dead dino. Hope it's a Kajingasaurus and not the Baryonyx. Uh, I wish you, there was a thing you could do to speed up these helicopter things. They take forever to raise and lower the dinosaurs. Asset delivery confirmed. Setting there we go. Task. Get all healed up over there. Yes, dead Kajingasaurus. Transport that one. Let it get healed up real quick before I release the other one. Check the T-Rex. Looks like its health is dropping, so it's got food. Obviously, it'll need to drink. And it get cured here in a second. They need to drink the water. Drink the water, T-Rex. Is it doing anything? There. It's cured now. Drink the water. Ah! It's attacking the vehicle. <laughs> That'd be funny. It likes... Drink your water. Surely it will go to water. What is the vehicle doing? It's done. Allow the T-Rex to drink its water. It's just trying to intimidate him and freak him out or something. 
Drink the water, T-Rex. There we go. There we go. That one's on. That's the Ceratosaurus. And we will transport it back to its base over here. Acknowledging asset collection request. There, how's your health doing? Oh, you're getting up there. Now that one's is it flying? Okay, it's coming in from there. Surely the T-Rex I think is doing good. It's at a hundred percent. Yeah, it's got enough grassland and forest. It is doing good. Hopefully it does not attack the walls. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, so, oh my gosh, I like barely moved any at all. How about you, Baryotics? Are you doing good? Don't attack the power fences. Feed her. Oh, it's that one. Yep, it's that one. For our two Gallimimuses that are left. I definitely need to resupply those at some point. We'll do that one. And then that one. There we go. Here we go. Ceratosaurus coming in. This was the picky dinosaur, but it had just enough stuff, so hopefully it'll be good. There it goes. Oh yeah, I forgot it. Oh, that one doesn't have a disease. So the next one will, because I I believe the thing I read said two out of three will have diseases. So that one was not, so it just, oh yeah, because it says it. So it's just food and water. Food and water. There, the Baryonyx is back up. Release that just so he can fight there. And it's, uh, oh yeah, just because it's hungry. Food and water is what it needs. the food and then it'll be getting the water and we're all good to go on that one once it drinks water it'll ask to bring in the next one so stop eating get the water get your water so we can move on gotta get going slowly meander over and drink the water You're standing in the water. Drink it. What the heck? He, like froze. There we go. It's like he like froze. Come on. Yes, Matria Canthosaurus, coming in. On route to collect Back the in asset. There. Yes, kill the Kajingasaurus and get your victories. Just there heard it you goes. wrapped up that dinosaur combat contract. Can't imagine it was pretty. Picking up asset. Oh, there we go. We got the large power station. Collecting asset. There we go. That one's coming in with its diseases. T Rex still doing good over there. T -t -t today there we go goodbye kajingasaurus and hello be funny if it or better if it could just pick it up and then move it over since it's right there but you know it likes to do weird things like that that one's still doing all good and here we go starting to lower Let's get our team ready to cure it of all its diseases. Transportation there we complete. go. Transportation complete. Oh yeah, it's like, what's that? It's our new power station. Cost a million bajillion dollars. Asset has been transported. Protected. Things like stuck. There is a new job available. I can't Can do I it. I don't have the car now. The there it goes. 
It was stuck on the other Jeep. So apparently I need to choose whatever Jeep this one is from now on. Number eight. Because that's the first one. And number seven is Park Crooked. I don't know. Don't get my other dino sick. Come on. You stay away, my tree. I can't source. Don't get sick. Oh, he missed. Shot into the water. There it goes. There, he's cured. Now he's just got to drink water. Come over here, drink some water. So we can end off the missions, because I think that should probably be the end of it, hopefully. T-Rex still doing good, at least for now. Until I decide to replace him. Nope, I thought I clicked delete. There we go. We don't need that one anymore. En route to feeder. There we go. Mission incoming. And we completed the mission. There we go. There, now we've got the Giga. Giga Nautosaurus is now available. All right. Let's check the box on this one. Check the box. Job sorted. You did well. Which is what was required. I always do well. Report I've just read. Ceratosaurus. Seems some of the dinosaurs suffered unnatural injuries. Unnatural injuries. You don't know anything about that, would you? Seems a little fishy. Oh, there we got our guest count above as well. We'll leave the T Rex. Hopefully, it'll stay good and high like that. What do we? Oh yeah, our new. We got the Giga. I say I assume everywhere else is now complete pretty much no new dinos available oh yeah so let's go oh now I could do the carno thing or yes yeah, carnivore thing who would we get now Paul Kirby mr. Kirby there we go so I think that's pretty much it we got all the missions done we still have I still have to work on Oh, there's the Carno, so I gotta get this. We're working on the Sukumimus. Let's see if we can get another mission real quick. I don't want the entertainment to drop, because that's always not good. An oh yeah, that one should be easy itself. too. And get the Carno unlocked there as well. So I just gotta work on that, and then that's the end of this. Of course, I'm once that count goes up or whatever, I will then sell the T-Rex, and then we'll start populating more of the park so i'm gonna put probably do those drake rexes and stuff and put them in here i'm um, not sure if i'll what i'll put in here i may switch this over to the light fencing just and put some herbivores in here may put the draco rexes in there and then put um i don't know what i'd put in here but i'll put something that's all i know and then of course I have the baryonyx and everything over there should be both of them all nice, happy, and healthy. Of course, all our anglos and then Ceratosaurus may put probably another one or two because I think they can hold up three and then need, re need to repopulate this area over here. Let's take a look at our large power stage, see how much room it takes up, see if we could. I was going to say, I may delete one out, this one out, to see if I can fit this. I may have to get rid of the storm defense station but i don't think it'll be a big deal yeah i think i'll try and replace that just so we can have more stuff going on there and then we got our first giga so i gotta work on that as well so we also have our new dig site of course almost done we got one two three four five six more to go which of course we unlock a bunch more dinos on Isla Sorna, our next style, which will we be moving to in the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of Jurassic World Evolution doing the mission there. I don't even remember what the mission was called, if it even says uh, field testing. That's what it is, field testing on Isla Pena. 
security mission number four there. So I hope you enjoyed this and I thank you for watching. Don't forget if you did enjoy to leave me a thumbs up. Put any comments you have for me down in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more Jurassic World Evolution videos and all the other videos we do on the channel. But I thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.